time for private lessons. Hey Sawyer. Hi. I have my normal camera today. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Sawyer and Ella are here first. Sawyer's dancing on a barrel, probably about to fall off. You're gonna fall off that and you're gonna be sad. Leia, let's go. No. It's just a little whip. I Your turn. That was pretty good though. You don't have to be so dramatic. Okay, well, I didn't think it was good. After a review, did you still think it was bad? It's okay. Push. Not bad. Hey, we're doing like one or two more and we're going to rock floor. What are you, climbing the wall over there? <laughs> Alright, lay out. Was that a good layout? No. Come on, you got it, sir. There it is. Great set. That wasn't bad. Get out of here. Yeah. Good job. Y'all gonna have a fun weekend? Yeah. Yeah? What are you gonna do? Um, we don't have Scott Camp on Thursday. No, we don't have Scott Camp on Korea. We just got levels. Just got done with the private lessons. They did really well. Sawyer absolutely crushed it. So did Ella. And I didn't film, but Kumaru and Marilyn were here. They did really good too. Now we're gonna film some shorts, some tumbling tutorials, some challenges, and everything under the sun. All right. Also, Kumaru brought me a birthday present. So let's see what's in here. A box. Oh, I got it. Okay. To Raul from Kumaru. What a nice card, by the way. Pretty. Is that her handwriting? You have no idea what this is. Wow. Yo, pretty dope though. Is it a Cherish Cat? Is that what it says? Oh, Cheshire, cat. Cheshire Cat. Yo, that's fire. Thank you. Kind of looks like Adriana. Hey. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> Wishing you a world-class birthday. Happy birthday, Royal. You're an amazing coach. You're so much better than Adriana. Hey. So nice. I'm kidding, I didn't say that, but it did say the first part. So sweet. First thing we're gonna do today is we're gonna jump up and see how high we can jump up. So level one, I'm a little nervous. Bro, time out. Bottomed out. I don't know. Hold on, we might have some technical difficulties. I don't, I don't know if I like that. Might as well just keep trying. All right, Adrian is up. Boing. Ooh. All right, level two. Sus, but it's fine. Okay, I'm up. That's all that matters is that I'm up. All right, Adriana, level two. Let's go. Sketchiest mat ever. Okay. How come you're not sliding off of it? All right, it's not bad. The problem is that the air track's super flat, so we're punching off of it and like bottoming out. And so it's super sketchy, but it's gonna be fine. I can't imagine we'll go too much higher, maybe like two or three more panel mats, but. All right, we got the next mat. Okay, now it's significantly higher. Okay, I'm up, I'm up, boys. Round three. Bunnies! Oh, that was really high. All right, cool. We have this long one, but it's kind of awkward. I think we got two more in us now that I think about it. I think we might be able to get a couple more in there. The next mat has arrived. Round four. You got it, big jump. Knees up. Oh, wow! Okay. <laughs> As I slid backwards, chill out with the bunnies. Yeah, easy. Ooh. Ooh. All right, last level, boys. Let's see if we can both make it. He's holding them. All right, last level. What is this, five? I'm pretty confident. I'm not going to lie. You consider how far you're sinking down into the mat. It might be at your ribs. Let's go. Eight. Hey! You made it, though. You made it, though. <laughs> Count it. Right, is it. I feel good about this. Bunnies? Oh, okay, that counts. We're in there. All right, good first video. All right, we're about to film a, a punch front drill. Adrian's gonna front flip over the barrel, and then I'm gonna start talking. So watch, pretend like I paused it. Hit it. Hold on, I forgot what I was gonna say. I didn't. I didn't plan what I was gonna say yet. Okay, hold on. Sorry, guys. Hold on. <laughs> My bad. Punch run drill, here you go. I don't know why I said here you go, but that's what we're going with. Today we're gonna show you a drill to help you with your punch run. I thought that was pretty good, right? Should we get some B-roll shots? Is that what we need to do usually? Okay, let me get all the talking shots now. All right, you're seeing the behind the scenes. This drill is awesome to help you with your punch run, helping you punch through your toes, rotate your hips over, and it kind of, the barrel acts as a spotter to put, put you safely on your feet. I messed that up. This drill is awesome to help you with your punch run. It helps you punching through your toes, helps you lift through your hips, rotating your hips over the top, and the barrel acts as a spotter. You wanna really focus on punching through your toes, making sure that you're hitting the small of your back on the barrel. Don't use your hands when you punch. You can at first if you're a little bit nervous, but the goal is to punch, hit the small of your back, and then step out. This drill is also really good to help with punch run step out. You can literally tumble right out of it. All right, I actually thought that was pretty good. All right, what should we do next? How to do a front full? 
Now, let's do some flyer drill. Flyer drill is a good idea, I got it. All right, trying to think about what we're gonna say. So I think I wanna be like, flyers, if you struggle with standing up into your lib, or if you struggle with standing up into your stunt, flyers, if you struggle with standing up into your stunts, oh, that's not good. Flyers, if you struggle with standing up fast into your stunt, here are some drills that can help. You, you wanna start from the knee first and just stand up? Yeah. Okay. A good drill to help you stand up quicker, standing down on your knee like this, focusing on standing up quick and pushing off this front leg. You wanna dip, shrug, stand up aggressively. Once you get that nailed down, you can start doing it onto an elevated surface. I thought that was pretty good. All right, so, even this. Oh, we can do it with the stairs. You want me to film you doing it? Yeah. Okay, cool. I'm gonna talk why you do it. If you have stairs at home, you can do this, putting your leg up on an elevated surface and standing all the way up, repeating that motion over and over again. If you're really feeling froggy, you can put your leg up, push through the shoulders, and jump into it to really help you explode. See how she's on a much higher surface now also, that's really helpful. And then when you're really cooking, you can do it on the floor and practice switch ups to the top. Switching, connecting that lib, hitting a good high V if you feel like it, and just jumping up. But really focus on exploding off that front leg. Boom, 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 boom. There's some quick flying tips. Let us know if you'd like to see some more and comment down below what kind of tips you wanna see. Okay, I actually thought that was pretty good. I feel good about that. We're gonna come film a skin right now, so you're not gonna be able to see that because I gotta turn it sideways, so sorry.